Have you ever noticed that when you get sick, your dog seems a little extra affectionate? They might cuddle with you more or just refuse to leave your side no matter where you go. This is not a coincidence. You see, your dog can actually tell when you are sick. And in some cases, your canine friend can even give you a warning before you get sick. This is all thanks to their amazing sense of smell. A dog's sense of smell is about 100,000 times stronger than humans. They have up to 300 million scent receptors in their noses, while humans only have about 6 million. When you get sick, your body goes through some very small changes, and dogs, with their amazing sense of smell, can pick up on these tiny changes. For example, cancerous cells release minute amounts of chemical compounds that do not exist in healthy tissue. And dogs are able to detect those changes long before they show up in a blood test. In one study, five trained domestic dogs were able to accurately identify lung cancer in 99% of patients. And they had a success rate of 88% in detecting breast cancer. What's incredible is that they were able to detect these cancers by sniffing the patient's breath. Dogs are also able to sense subtle changes when a narcoleptic attack is coming on. Narcolepsy is a brain disorder that affects the ability to control sleep-wake cycles. This can mean a person suddenly falls asleep even in the middle of a task. Experts say that dogs are able to detect a narcoleptic attack five minutes before it happens. A study found that two trained dogs detected 11 out of 12 narcolepsy patients using sweat samples, demonstrating that dogs can detect a distinct scent for the disorder. One study discovered that dogs are efficient in detecting sudden blood sugar drops in people with type 1 diabetes. The research results noted that 65% of dogs warned their diabetic pet parents of the onset of a hypoglycemic attack by whining and barking. Although not life-threatening, migraines can certainly be debilitating, causing sufferers to experience hours, if not days, of intense pain. One study reported that 60% of polled migraine sufferers said their family dog had alerted them to an impending headache an hour or two in advance. Some severe migraine sufferers have service dogs specifically trained to hone in on serotonin spikes in the blood. They are able to warn their owners of the brutal stroke-like symptoms up to two hours in advance, early enough to take medication and stop the attack before it happens. Now, does this mean we should have dogs in lab coats and clinics? Not exactly, as this may not be the best idea for a variety of reasons, including the cost of their training. But what if we could create an electronic version of the dog nose that can detect diabetes, cancer, and other illnesses? Researchers have already created a digital dog nose that can detect explosives. Once we know for sure what trained dogs detect in patients who get sick, there's no reason why a medical version of this device couldn't exist.